Hey everyone, it's Nick from Pioneer Chrysler Jeep and today I have a 2019 Ram 1500 Rebel that I'm going to do a little walk around on with you. So obviously the first thing you notice going around the front there is the redesign. So it still has the same Rebel front grille look to it, but the rest of the front end is redesigned just with all the other 19 1500s. Going around, you have your all-season tires down there. It's more of the sleek, sporty look, but the off-road carries over. On the back, you have the really big Ram emblem. This one is equipped with the tow package group on it. So overall, just like the other 19s, including the Sport that I've already done the review on, it has more aerodynamics to it. The engine's pushed back about two feet for better center of gravity and better fuel economy. So just to show you under the hood quickly, it does still have the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi. And as I just said, it has been moved back a little bit for a better center of gravity. It provides more than enough power to this truck for on-road and off-roading. For wheels, we have the 18 inch wheels with the off-road all season tires on them. You have the heavy duty shocks underneath and you also have a locking rear axle for off-roading. On the interior, like other Rebels, you have all the red accents in leather. And the Rebel seats. So it actually does have kind of a, uh, I'm not sure, it's kind of a cloth mesh insert, which are super comfortable. Really, it's a really well done interior, and the colors, obviously black and red, are go together so well. In the 2019 models, they've given the backseat passengers some extra legroom. You see there's quite a bit. You can easily fit full-sized adults back here. They've kept the good things like the in-floor storage, really handy. Underneath the seats, you have your some more storage under here. All the seats do flip up. <laughs> Making for a lot of room back here if you don't want to throw everything in the, in the back. Before we hop into the interior, a couple features that are optional just to show you are these running boards on the side. It does have an upgraded speaker system and also a panoramic sunroof. All optional equipment that this one does have. So now on the interior you'll notice a few things if you've sat in a 18 Ram. You'll notice the steering wheel on the 19 is different. Different look. The, uh, the Ram emblem itself looks to be uh, updated a little bit. You do have an LCD display in the middle here between your gauges that is fully customizable. You just toggle through by using your switches right here on the steering wheel. So it has all the fun stuff like fuel economy, tire pressure. And then right down here, this is the gear shift. But what is different in the Rebel compared to other Rams is this right down here, the axle lock, which locks the rear axles for off-roading. The Uconnect system in the 19 Rams has been changed a little bit. It does have a different look to it. It's more sharp. The screen itself is definitely more sharp. Uh, same thing as other Uconnects though. On the bottom you have all your important stuff. So your radio, media, climate, apps, seat controls. For seat controls in this one you actually do still have the heated steering wheel and the heated seats. As well as you can check your backup camera even when you're driving if that's something you wanted to do. Other than that in the center console you also have buttons for the heated seats and heated steering wheel all your climate controls down here. And what I like that they did is they made little switches here instead of buttons, just for things like traction control and front and rear parking sensors. You can turn them off separately now. You have your trailer brake as well. And one thing that they've done all over the place is plugins. So between all the ones down here, you have one up top here. There's even a few in the center console here that I'll show you in a second, but there are tons of plugins for all your electronics. 
The theme with the center console is without a doubt storage. This truck has so much storage in it, it's crazy. So you can have uh, the center console like this. You can move it back for a, a huge tub of storage underneath. That's another plug-in down there. Or if you move this forward, you have your first center console. But then below that is like a crazy deep center console and it's kind of interesting you have pictures of the different generations of rams on the inside of the center console here as well for some reason they decided to put trigonometry underneath the center console armrest which is hey you never know i guess just looking through the interior here i've noticed something kind of different so obviously cup holders are a big thing in a lot of vehicles now so you have two up here Two back here, two back there, but then in both of the doors down below here, they've put in cup holders that are like this weird foamy removable material, but uh, if you need more cup holders, I guess you can just get more and put them in and take them out. Well everyone, this has been the 2019 Rebel. If you have any more questions or want to come take a look, feel free to give us a call at Pioneer Chrysler Jeep. And we will see you soon. Small town service, big city selection.